Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel and welcome back to another video. So you guys, it's grocery haul day. Um, we went to Walmart and Harris Teeter. Now you guys, I hit the mother load at Harris Teeter. It was a beautiful situation. I almost passed it and the Holy Spirit called me back. I was like, yes, Lord, because I almost didn't go to the meat section today. I was limited on money. I had $60 for my regular groceries. And then child support came in, so that was an extra $50. So that was $110. Well, then I got that check from uh, the dentist's office, so that was another $50. And then I also had a $25 stock up prep. So I ended up having like $180 to go grocery shopping with, which is twice what I normally have, plus a little bit. So I had originally planned on stocking up, you know, canned goods, um, pastas, that type of stuff, but the meat was the best deal this week. Ma'am is eating her meal. If you hear chomping in the back, it is the dog. So because I found such good deals, I just went ahead and bought them and um, lived my best life. Now we just have to find space in the freezer for it. I don't know if we have it, but we're going to do our best. We are going to do some prep ahead, so we'll have some meat for this week. So let me start with Walmart. Um, I spent $63 at Walmart. Uh, it's like $62.92. So I got a bunch of bananas. We are kind of going whole 30, whole 30 with some keto days. So still going to be mainly trim healthy mama, but a lot of whole 30. Um, just when you look at things like keto ingredients, I was going down the condiment aisle and um, the Primal Kitchen mayonnaise was $9 for a small thing of mayonnaise. That's not sustainable on a small income like I have. So I've got to make it work for me. I've got a bunch of bananas. They were, I think, $0.59 cents a pound. I don't remember. These um, Easy Peel Mandarins were $4 and some change. The strawberries, I got the two pounds, was $4 and some change. Then we also got these um, water... Uh, flavor packets they were 348 i believe the cauliflower is a little disappointed in this this was the walmart brand or the great value right beside the organic brand which was a dollar 87 and i didn't see um the price for this 212 and i could not go back and put it back and exchange it out i've got four of those gala apples were like um, 474 so i picked up those for the kids Tilapia, the four pound bag was $19.23. I was looking for salmon as well. They did not have salmon. Raw shrimp, these are the extra large. They were over $6, I think $6.44. Picked up a big thing of baby spinach. That was $3.12. Alfredo classic was $1.50. And then the milk, that's gone up. It was $2.16. Then I picked up some of this California style uh, veggies. I got four of those. And so they were a dollar a piece. So I ended up paying $62 over at Walmart. I knew the fish was going to be expensive. And I was, like I said, trying to find salmon as well, but I could not find it. Then moving into uh, Harris Teeter. And again, this is where I got, this is where I got the best deals. So um, I just happened to be going past the meat. I almost didn't go past the meat. And they had these chickens for $1.49 a pound. Well, this was one of the smallest ones that I got for four sixty three. dollars So I was like, okay, I'll pick up this chicken and I'll just kind of peruse because I'm always looking for yellow tags. Well, I didn't see any yellow tags that were for a substantial amount of meat that we could use. But they did have this sweet Italian sausage, $4.99, buy one, get one free. So I got two pounds for $5.00. These uh, white button mushrooms were three for five, so $1.67. We love the zero pasta. It was $1.99. It's the cheapest I've been able to find it. So I picked up two of the spaghetti and two of the fettuccine. This was the deal of the day. They had this um, pork shoulder butt roast, $0.99 cents, um, per pound. It's normally $2.49, but they had it um, $0.99 cents per pound if you were a Vic member. So this was eighteen thirteen, but I paid seven twenty one, and it is seven point two eight pounds. So that'll be a lot of meals. Then I had um, this one was twenty two nineteen. I paid eight eighty two, and it's eight point nine pounds. So if you do a pound of meat per meal, this is seven 
seven meals and this is almost nine meals. So seven and nine is 16 meals, right? So that is a good deal. They had this Laughing Cow Cheese. It was $4.49, buy two, get three free. So I bought two and I got three free. And then they had the uh, but country ribs and the country steak, but they didn't have any steak. They had ribs. They were 99 cents a pound as well. So I got one for 287. This is 322, 260, 325, 280, and then another one for 315. So as I was putting these in my cart, the uh, meat guy was coming out with another tray of those. He's like, "Do you want any more?" And had I had room in my cart, I mean, room in my freezer for them, I sure would have gotten them because I only run up on this deal every now and then. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. That's easily 12 meals plus another 16 meals. That's 28 meat meals. And I got out of um, Harris Teeter, the, one of the cheapest trips with all this amount of meat. Um, cat, uh, lettuce was $1.49. Eggs. Now, my friend Tiffany sent me a, a text saying eggs were uh, cheap this week. Not at my Harris Teeter. The 18 count eggs were three sixty nine, and the 30 count were over five dollars. At Walmart, the 60 count were thirteen dollars. I was like, "What in the country Christmas is going on here?" Uh, Sweet Baby Ray's mild buffalo sauce was three seventy nine. Buy one get one free, and then there was a coupon. Uh, for a dollar off of each so 379 subtract two dollars so a dollar 79 for two or 90 cents each this is the highland crest uh block cheese eight ounces was a dollar 49 so i picked up two of those then i got this uh, sharp white cheddar slices for 299 a bag of eight pound potatoes was 299 and then they had the land of lakes whipped salted butter was two for four dollars so this is what I got from Walmart. I meant from Harris Teeter. I'm sorry. Harris Teeter and I spent $91 and some change. $91.47, I believe. It was over $170. And then when I went to do my VIC card, it got it down to $91 and some change. So that is what I got from Harris Teeter. And this is what I got from Walmart. So again, some meals. We'll probably do some pulled pork or I may, may try to do the uh, uh, carne asada, like when you add in the uh, bottle of diet drink and, and do it that way, make pulled pork that way, and then have like pulled pork with lettuce and cheese, not with a, a wrap or a bun. We're trying to stay away from that as much as we can. Or we can put the meat over a potato. We can have baked potatoes and put the meat over that with cheese. Then, of course, we can also, I thought I could do some of this buffalo sauce and try it on the pork and see how that worked. We could also have pork and eggs or eggs, potatoes, and pork as a meal. We could do some of the shrooms with some of the spinach and the eggs. Or we could do a um, seafood frittata with the shrimp and the eggs. Bake a chicken or two just because with some we could have uh, roasted apples we could do cauliflower risotto with the cauli rice and the mushrooms and some spinach we could also do a pasta meal with the sweet italian sausage and the zero pasta plus the sauce so there's a oh i wanted to put some tilapia in the air fryer and try that and maybe do that with some of the um, California style medley veggies. So there's some options here for meals. Couple things that we're going to try this week as far as getting meal prep done. My evenings are just slammed. I am absolutely slammed every single day of this week, every single day of every week. But that is such as life, right? But best deals ever at Harris Teeter. Look for the Boston butt um, roast and the steaks and the ribs, ninety nine cents per pound and so it was a kicking deal this week i will take it there it is you guys our grocery haul minor meal um, a mini meal plan if you like the video thumb it up don't forget to subscribe and we will see you guys next time bye now